Hey there, welcome to our beginner's guide on mastering for loops. Are you ready to dive into the fascinating world of for loops? Trust me, it's going to be an exciting journey. Don't worry, I'm here to make it super easy and fun for you. By the end of this video, you'll be a for loop pro. So, what exactly is a for loop? It's a fundamental concept in programming that you'll use all the time. Well, imagine you have a task that you need to repeat multiple times. It could be anything from counting numbers to processing items in a list. Instead of doing it manually over and over again, a for loop automatically repeats it for you. Sounds pretty cool, right? It's like having a personal assistant for repetitive tasks. Let's break it down with a simple real-life example. This will help you understand how for loops work in a practical sense. Imagine you have 10 candies and you want to give one to each of your 10 friends. How would you do it? Instead of thinking about each step, you just follow this simple rule. Give one candy to each friend until they're all served. Give one candy to each friend until they're all served. This is essentially what a for loop does in programming. And just like that, you've used a for loop without even realizing it. Here's another example to make it even clearer. Picture a teacher checking the homework of all students in the class. This is another scenario where a for loop can be applied. They start with the first student, then move to the next, and continue until they've checked everyone's homework. It's systematic and efficient. Again, that's a for loop in action. It's all about repeating a set of instructions until a condition is met. Now let's visualize this with an animated character. This will help you see the concept in a more dynamic way. Imagine our character is stacking blocks. Each block represents a step in the loop. Each time they pick up a block and place it on the stack, we see a counter on the screen tracking their progress. This visual cue helps us understand the loop's iteration. One block, two blocks, three blocks, until all the blocks are stacked. The loop continues until the task is complete. Notice how every step follows the same rule. Pick up a block and place it on the stack until the task is complete. This consistency is key to understanding for loops. This is the essence of a for loop. It's a powerful tool that simplifies repetitive tasks. It saves time and avoids manual repetition by automating the process. Imagine how much more efficient you can be with this knowledge. So, what are the key takeaways here? Let's summarize the main points. A for loop starts from the first item and moves to the last. It follows a sequence, ensuring every item is processed. Each step follows the same rule until the task is done. This uniformity makes it easy to predict and control, and it makes our lives so much easier by automating repetitive tasks. No more manual labor for repetitive actions. Now here's an interactive challenge for you. Let's see if you can identify for loops in your daily life. Can you think of any other daily tasks where you follow a loop without realizing it? There are more than you might think. How about brushing your teeth? It's a perfect example. You start brushing, move to each section of your mouth and continue until every tooth is clean. Or climbing stairs. Another great example. One step at a time until you reach the top. Packing lunch boxes? It's all about repetition. Filling one box after another until they're all packed. Each task follows a loop. The possibilities are endless, and that's what makes for loop so powerful and versatile. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this guide helpful. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more fun and easy to understand programming examples. See you next time. Happy coding.